Hey, what's up guys? It's Anzo here today. Come with you with another tech unboxing and review for you guys today. As you see, I already have it pre-opened just for you, just for sake of the video. But I hope you like this one. It's about a rice cooker and really great on how these work. So I can't wait to get in the review. Guys, so today, like I said before, this is the Black & Decker rice cooker um what's great about rice cookers is that they mainly help with you making like perfect rice for as say sushi or other products such as like wild rice and it really helps to use these and it makes the perfect consistency on what type of rice you would like to cook say yellow rice or just straight white rice and Chipotle actually uses these for their rice so if you're a fan of them this is what they use for the rice so we'll go ahead and open it up and see what you get in the box alright as you see here you're gonna go ahead and automatically get your manual and I won't be I'll already be telling you about what it does and all that in the video so I don't think you need that now next here you got a little bit of packaging uh, holder and this next part is the uh, bowl that you're going to cook the rice in, if you see right here. This is actually glass, so I don't want to touch any of that. And then you have another part. Go ahead and take some of this out. You're going to get a cup to put your rice in, or water, I'm guessing. Next, you're going to get a get a top right here, as you see. Um, here we go. Here's a glass top. It's actually really, really nice, considering. And now right here, you're going to get a spoon, I guess, to stir your rice with, which is even better that they added that. And as you see here, this is probably your uh, filter or strainer on, or I guess it lets the air out for the rice so the moisture doesn't get all together and um, that's basically it so I'll come back to you once I get everything set up okay so now that I got basically everything set up except I have not plugged this in yet but basically this is what it is this is your tempered glass lid right here so it is shattered proof also they give you a little vent here now this next part is the steaming pot right here and this would select the steam out and I'm guessing what happens is that the air comes up from this right here it comes up from this and then after that it will come out into this little hole right here as you see there now the next part on this as you see here is the non-stick pot and this holds up to approximately they're saying at eight cups so they're saying eight cups approximately for all of that now if you look a little bit closer on here let me move this up for you and you see it says the keep warm light is right here this is your cooking light and as well as your cooking switch now if you push that down that's what will allow it to cook now this next part right here this is to you to serve your uh, rice and I, I kind of think it's a little cheap what they added to this and one thing I forgot to tell you is this is the 14 cup maker so I know it says 8 cups here but you can put up to 14 cups of rice which is even better that it even makes that much of rice now this part is your stirring like I said earlier in the video this is your stirring spoon and that's it that's all to it now the cooking times are definitely going to vary for sure on how you want to actually use this product or uh, the type of rice you're going to use like I said early in the video again you can use yellow rice white rice black rice um, wild rice there's so many types but the problem is that you can't make it the right way now the thing with shusi you have to use a rice maker if you want to make shusi at your house and the reason for that being is that there's a certain consistency with making like a shusi shusi rice 
to actually make the shoesy. So it has to be sticky and like, I guess like steamy and hot. So I don't really know all the gist about shoesy and how they make it, but that's a little bit on what you're going to want to do for it. But once again, this has been another video by me, Angelo Giles, and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, once again, if you did like this video, remember to give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. And then comment and tell me why in the description below. Also, one last thing, follow me on Instagram at Angelo.Savage. Also, subscribe to the channel for more content. And if you haven't already, please check out my video on the Tiavana Perfect Tea Maker as you see here and that's about it i hope you enjoyed this video once again and i'll see you in the next one Peace.